Hey everybody and welcome back to my channel. So today I have a Dollar Tree haul and it's I have it's pretty big. I have a lot of stuff here. So let's just get started. So I love mineral water and I drink I drink mineral water every day. I love it, love it. And I was so excited when I went into one of the Dollar Trees and I saw this at my Dollar Tree. It's the Green Apple Sparkling Natural Mineral Water. I love this stuff. And you get six bottles for one dollar. So if you see these and you like mineral water, I this is such a good deal. So I wanted to buy them all out because I really like this so much, but I was nice and didn't buy them all out, but I, oh my goodness, if, I, I love this stuff. I drink it all the time. It's always with me, so I totally stocked up on this. I was just, this is such a phenomenal deal on this stuff, so um, be on the lookout for your Dollar Tree for these because if you have them and you like mineral water, you might like this one. The Green Apple's amazing. They have other different flavors. The only one that I saw at my Dollar Tree was the Green Apple, but if you're in the store and you see them and if you like them, you might want to try these. Um, I really, I mean, I love them. I think they're great. So yes, this was just like my big woohoo! <laughs> Fine, because I was so excited to find these. So then my next thing I found so many back to school stuff at the Dollar Tree. I'm so excited. I think Office Depot is starting to have every Sunday they come out with their sales ads and you can get, you know, erasers for pennies and composition notebooks for pennies and, you know, spiral notebooks for 15 cents. So if you're interested in, um, those deals, let me know in the comments below because I can take you through the store and show you the deals, how to get them, what's all involved. Last year, I mean, I do it every year and I have stockpiles of stuff. So the Dollar Tree deals are really good, but you can get better deals at Office Depot, Staples, you know. So if you're interested, let me know in the comments below and I can start doing those every Sunday. I film probably Sunday early in the morning, get the good deals, and then come home, film for you guys, and try to upload it as soon as I can, hopefully that Sunday night or the next morning Monday, so that you guys can run out and get those good deals before they're all gone, because they are such, such good deals. But Dollar Tree has some really cute stuff. So I found these little, um, can you see that? So I found these and I thought these were, they're just like the two pocket folders, but I thought these were so cute. Let me open these up. You can draw on these, which I think is so cool because I know all of my girls' teachers, they do their work and then after they're done, they're allowed to, you know, do coloring books or doodle um, while they're waiting. And for some reason, my kids always get done fast and they're just sitting there and they like to color and read. So I thought this would be perfect for school. And look how cute this is. I mean, and she can draw, it's just the two pocket folders, and it's kind of, it's paper, so they probably won't last all school year, but I just thought that this would be so cute for her to color in, um, and I they had tons of them, so here's another one, and here's the back, and then... I'm just going to open all these up for you guys so you can see them better. So that way if you see them with your Dollar Tree and you like them, you can grab them. Here's the owl. And then it just has like the leaf branches on the back. And then this one, front and back, it's just the butterflies. And then the last folder. But these were so good. I might have to go back and get some more. And then here's this one. It's the same as the back. 
And then here's another little design, and the front and back is exactly the same. But yeah, I mean, I thought these were good. So, I, I mean, basically 50 cents a piece. Not, I mean, not a bad deal, especially for stuff like that, you know. They're unique, they're different. So this would be a good deal. Kids love to color. I think these are awesome because they can make it their own. So definitely something you might want to pick up. So then the next one, you saw at my other Dollar Tree haul. I hauled these cute little plastic folders. And so I found the Owl. And it just, again, it's just, um, they're just plastic. So. So here's what the Owl looks like opened up. And it's called Pocket Buddies. These are really nice quality. And then, I mean, I think it's so cute inside. But I had to pick this one up. And then they have the monkey, which I which I thought was super cute. And this is what it looks like when it's out of the package. It's really nice quality. I think it's super cute. Looks like that. And two on the front, each one of them opens up like this. So not only can you put stuff inside, but you can put stuff outside too. So I think, I mean, they're and basically 50 cents a piece. These are cute, they're unique. Um, definitely a good buy for these. And they'll probably last longer than the paper ones, but the colored paper ones were just too fun. So I had to pick those up. And then they, I found these pencil cases, and I thought these were so darn stinking cute. Let me open this up. You can kind of see it. But it just says, OMG, ha ha ha. And it just opens up like that. And then here's another one, just a plain one. But I thought these would be cute. They can put two different things in. Maybe they're pencils and then bigger things in here. And then if they need to go to class and they just need pencils and they don't need, you know, highlighters or anything, they can just take this and leave this in their locker. But it just gives them options. And I just thought these were so stinking cute. So I picked up one, picked up this. And then my other daughter, she wants to do flowers this year. That's her theme for her back to school. So I found the flowers like this. And once again, just has a little pouch with the little flowers and then the pink pouch. But I mean, two for the price of one. I mean, a dollar so 50 cents each for these. I mean, not a bad, not a bad price. Speaking with the flower theme, which the Dollar Tree has some amazing things because a lot of things that they have go with each other, which I was super excited. So for the flower pencil pouch. And then I found these composition notebooks have the flowers on them. You know, just your regular composition notebook, but I thought, this is so cute! And here's the back. So we got this, and then I found this one that just says smile. It's got a camera, and then the camera in the back. I just thought these were so cute and cheery. Like I said, we can get them for a penny, <clears throat> but they're just the plain ones. They don't have colors or, you know, anything like that. So I thought, I mean, I had to get these. They're just too fun. Gotta have some fun, like, back to school stuff. And then my other daughter, she's getting ready to go into high school, which I cannot believe I have a high schooler. So I thought these were super cute because they're so, I, they look grown up to me. They don't look kitty-ish, but I just thought these were so pretty. So I got this one for her and then I fell in love with this one. I mean, it's the purple chandelier. I mean, how cute is this? So I had to pick those up. So just some, you know, pop of color and something fun. Um, and they had so many different ones, dogs and cats, and just really cute ones this year. So Dollar Tree, you're stepping up your game because you're bringing out some really cute stuff. 
so speaking with, I mean, still back to school stuff, my daughter, she has a lot of AP classes and advanced classes, and they suggested you need to get a student journal or a student planner. And so I found two different types. So here's this one with the flowers for one of my daughter who wants the flowers. And then I have a little polka dots with like an ombre effect. And I really liked these because, I mean, look how cute, look how like awesome that is. So it's just got the dates and it just divides it. But I thought this was so cute. So she can use this in the back. It gives you all your holidays, just like a regular planner. And they had all different, like, I mean, just stacks of them in all different kinds, um, different colors. But yeah, so these I thought were a good deal for a dollar. And I mean, it helps your kids get organized and plan better, especially if you have kid, bigger kids that are going into high school or middle school. These are good things to learn to start learning to write your schedule down, to learn how to plan and, and life building skills for planners. So. I thought these were amazing. And then I found different kinds, so I had to pick a, pick them up because I thought, well, they can just, you know, pick which one they want. If not, they, you know, if they pick one and they don't like the other, they can give it to friends or use one for, you know, their everyday life and one for school. So I thought these were cool. I They are the student monthly planners. And um, I like this one because, you know, this planner belongs to, it has all this information that they can write down, um, birthdays and anniversaries that they can write down, and then it gives you like the whole months, and then it gives you like this, which I thought was good, and then I really liked that it gives you a personal um, directory so that they can write down their friends phone numbers or any of that good stuff and then this is I love it it has a conversion table and then a abbreviation table and then just like you know the moon and all that different stuff so I thought these were really really awesome so and they definitely had a lot at all of my Dollar Trees and they had all different kinds um, so yeah if you're needy if your ch children's needing uh, you know a planner I would totally recommend these I mean for a dollar you can't go wrong I mean it's 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 awesome so speaking with more school stuff I'm telling you guys <laughs> They're starting to put all their school stuff out and there's some really, really good stuff. So I've talked about this before. My daughters, you know, they're all into their lockers. They want them to look cute. And so when I found these, they're the dry eraser boards and they came in all different colors. So I got a blue and a purple because these are my daughter's favorite colors. But I thought this would be cute to put in their locker. And then it has the magnet right here so it can hang right on their locker they can write notes I mean anything they can draw they can doodle they can do whatever but it's just another thing to keep them organized or hopefully they'll be able to keep themselves organized and something fun for them to do and I mean they love to decorate their locker so for a dollar I'm willing to help them out and let them have a cool locker so then I found these dry eraser locker wallpaper and the package looks like this. I got two, one for each daughter. Let me take it out so I can show you guys. So it sticks on to their locker. But isn't this so cute I thought this was just so adorable I mean they can write their little sayings I like paper stuck to me they can write little sayings on here or just little quotes or funny things but I thought this would be so cute to put in their locker and they had all different kinds they had these they had ones that had zebra prints and you know animal prints and all different kinds so if your kids are you know going to middle school or high school or 
they need locker stuff, the Dollar Tree is where it's at because Walmart, Target, I mean, they're a lot more expensive for their locker stuff and it's, I mean, might as well just go to the Dollar Tree, save your money. They have some really cute stuff, so we, I had to pick up two because I mean, they're just going to have really cool lockers this year and I'll like win mom points because their lockers will be super cute. And the next thing I found these mechanical pencils. I got two, one for each of my big girls, but they're pop art mechanical pencils and they're refillable. So I thought these were super cute. So any type of little fun thing, um, they are a Greenbrier product, but I just, I had to pick these up. And then they had pencil lead and pencil lead can sometimes be expensive. So I picked up two packs of the pencil lead because I know a lot of middle schools, or at least in my area, they require mechanical pencils. That's what you have to write with. Um, so I stock up me on mechanical pencil stuff because that's what the teachers want. They, they don't really use regular pencils anymore. They want the mechanical pencils. I'm not sure why. That's just our district likes mechanical pencils. And so that is the big thing that's always, always on their list. So when I find cool mechanical pencils, <clears throat> especially the lead refills, I stock up on them because they go through them super fast, especially middle school, high school. They're always writing lots more work. So definitely, this is definitely a good buy. And then, so getting down almost to my last of my school products. So I found this Elmer's school tape and glue pen. And I thought this was super cute. I got two packs. I thought this is super cute for the kids. I don't know if they'll use them, but a school glue pen with precision tip applies easily and dries clear, making it ideal for children and school projects. So I got two of them, put them in our stash. You never know when you need this. It's always good to be prepared because you never know what kind of project they're going to need and then you have to rush down to like Walmart or Target or whatever to try to find it. So now I'll be prepared if anything should arise this school year that we need this. I have it. And then my last school things, and it has to do with their lockers. I thought these were super cute. They are the uh, magnetic holder like pencils I mean you can do pencils you can do anything in here they can put their cell phones in here and it just it just sticks on their locker there's the magnetic and yeah I thought these were cute something you know to put in their locker another thing to help keep them organized because I know sometimes their lockers can get really messy really fast and it looks super bad and then they can't find anything so I'm hoping that this will help them keep organization in their locker. So, yep. And they had all different colors, but, and I've seen these, you know, Walmart, Target, and they go for three, four, five dollars, depending, you know, but for a dollar, these are, I mean, these are not bad. So, yeah, how to get those. Okay, so I'm doing, I'm filming what's in my kids' summer bag very soon, and I'm almost done with it, and then I went to the Dollar Tree and I found some more stuff. So, I thought these were super cute, so I'm putting these in their bags. But they are emergency selfie kits. Isn't that so funny? It says 10 bobby pins, 2 jaw clips, 15 rubber bands, and 2 elastics. So this is what it looks like. But I thought this would be super cute to put in their bag. And honestly, like, if you have birthdays of teenage girls, you know, stock up. You can put this, you know, in with, like, a selfie stick and some, like, makeup. These would make really good stocking stuffers or gifts for teenagers. I just thought these were so cute. So I had to pick up two. And then, let's see. So then hair products, I found some more of the, um, more of like the little rubber bands. Yeah, super cute, so nice and colorful. So yeah, I had to pick these up, thought these were super cute. And then I got these, they're just the basic 
um, brown, and then the fun little rubber bands to go with them. And then I found these. I know a lot of you guys have been hauling them. They're the um, little rubber bands that have like the little pretty detail on them. Um, you guys have been hauling these and I'm like, oh, these look so cute. I want them, but my store never had them. So now they're starting to have them. So if you still haven't been able to find them, it, you might now. Um, it's just funny how some stores get them faster than others and some take forever. And sometimes all my Dollar Trees never have any like the stuff that other people are hauling. So I was excited to find these. And then kind of stocking stuffers. I know it's like July, but I'm always thinking ahead and Dollar Tree had some really cute things to put in my little four-year-old stocking. So I found this frozen headband and this is what it looks like. But I thought this was super cute. She loves headbands and what little girl doesn't like frozen. Um, and this was not in the hair section. It was by the mints, like the frozen mints, like on a little end cap and the frozen water bottles and stuff. So Dollar Tree's been weird. They've been putting different things in different places that you wouldn't think these would be, but that's, they, that's where they were. So I had to pick this one up. And then for her stocking, these I thought were super cute. They're little pet shop little rings. So I got two of them to put in her stocking. I thought these were really cute. I mean, a dollar, they, I mean, they're definitely a lot more in the store. So this is a thing that I can put in her stocking. And, you know, one less thing I can cross off my list of getting. So when it's Christmas time, I don't have to be like, oh my gosh, I have to get so much stuff. If I get stuff little by little, it's going to be easy and I don't have to think about it and way less stress on me, which I love. So, yeah. Then I found this little etcher sketch and it comes with a pin that's connected. I thought this would be good to put in her to-go bag when we're running to the beach or running errands. Um, she has Kindles and all different kinds of stuff, but it's just one extra thing that I can put in her bag that if she gets bored of the other stuff, I always have a backup. She can draw, and what kid doesn't like to draw? She's always wanting to draw on my, on my stuff, so I thought this would be good to keep in the bag. Okay. So I finally, finally found the Hello Kitty toothbrushes. So I picked up two and they had tons of Dr. McStuffins. I mean, they were stocked, but they're putting the toothbrushes in not the tooth like department. This was in the baby section by like the lotions and like all that stuff, just randomly a whole box sitting in the baby section. I don't know why Dollar Tree is being really weird with positioning their things lately, but if you're looking for these and you're running into, you know, just the toothbrush section, you might want to just look around the store because lately I've been seeing random things being stocked in different aisles, which makes no sense to me, but I found them and super excited, so hopefully I can find, I think, is there a Ninja Turtle or, I can't remember, hopefully I can find like the boy, because the boy won, because I know my son doesn't want the Dr. Mustafin and he definitely does not want the Hello Kitty. He's the only boy out of all these girls, so yeah, he, he won't do it. <laughs> so hopefully I can find the boy one. Okay, now a lot of you guys have been hauling this, and it's the Daily Defense with Coconut Oil. I got the shampoo and the conditioner. We were running out of shampoo and conditioner, and I hadn't gone to Target yet. It was just Dollar Tree, and I just thought, you know, everyone's been hauling them. You know, I sh let's give them a try. Let me know in the comments down below if you guys like this, if it's good, what's your opinion on these. Um, because I have not used this yet. So I got the shampoo and conditioner. And then I got the moisturizing yeah. macadamia nut shampoo. But they didn't have the conditioner. But I thought, well, I'll just pick this up. Why not? 
And then I got the Daily Defense Coconut Oil Frizz Deep Conditioner. Ooh. Yeah, if you've used any of this Daily Defense stuff, let me know and tell me like how you like them because I have not tried it. I'm curious to see if you've tried it and liked it. So then I found the Retinol Face Mask, which I... I love my face mask. I use them once a week. So I got these. I've tried lots of the Dollar Tree face masks. I really like them. Um, I haven't tried this one yet and people have been hauling these for a long time and I've never ever 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 seen them in my store. Not once. And then now they're starting to put them out. So I had to, I had to get them. I love face masks. I use them once a week. It just it feels so nice. It gives me a little mommy time, a little pampering time, and so I had to pick these up. Okay, getting down to the last of it. So I found this scent, this sign, and I've hauled the littler signs before with different things. For some reason, I've never seen this one, and I don't know why I haven't. Um, it says, count your smiles instead of your tears, count your courage instead of your fears. And I just thought this was super cute, so I had to pick this one up, add it to my collection. Like again, it just has a little thing where you can hook it to your wall. But yeah, I had to pick this one up. And so I know everybody's been hauling these, and I when I saw... Some of you guys haul these. I was like, oh my gosh, I really hope that I get them in my store because sometimes I can't find them. So I found them. Their Adventure Awaits. And then Fabulous. Think Happy. And she leaves a little sparkle wherever she goes. And put these in my four-year-old's room. I thought these were all, they're just bright, they're cheery, they're cute. So I'm excited that I found them. But I haven't found the banks yet. I was so excited when I was seeing several of you guys haul the banks. And then I was like, okay, maybe I'll find them too. No. So maybe they'll come to me. I'm not sure. Sometimes my Dollar Tree is really fast about getting things. And other times... It's not, so I'm looking out for those because I thought those would be a good Christmas gift. And I know on the tar Target dollar spot, they had little banks and those were like, I think three, three bucks, maybe five bucks, but for a dollar, that's a good deal. So hopefully I can find those. It wouldn't be a Dollar Tree haul without socks. <laughs> so I have been stocking up on my kids' socks for next school year. And I thought I need to get the big girl socks. And I found these. And I know some of you guys have been hauling these. They're the two pack of socks. So I got the purple for one of my daughters. She likes purple. And then it's got kind of like it breathes at the top. It's got like little holes in it. But I thought this would this is super cute. Two for a dollar instead of like one dollar for a sock. So Stocking up on socks for them. One less thing I have to worry about. Check it off my list. And then, you know, on to the next. So I got those in purple. And then I got these in blue. And they're just the two packs of socks. So thought these were a good deal. And I know my little one has probably too many socks. But darn it, Dollar Tree. They can't, I don't think she... But then maybe she does need new socks. But, you know... Maybe she needs more socks because, I don't know. I just, I had to get these. They were super cute. Look, they had like little puppies on them. So I had to get this one and then it just has the stripes. And then the purple and gray. And then they had more puppies. So I had to get more. I had to get more. So just the little puppies or the little dogs. And then the gray and then the stripes so yeah I I mean Dollar Tree is doing amazing but that's my haul for this week you guys it from my Dollar Tree haul you guys if you like this video give me a big thumbs up and if you're new to my channel don't forget to hit that subscribe button on your way out and thank you so much for watching until next time